Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Yes? All right, Vigilant. It's good to see you all here. Pleases me. I think we only have a few more recruits that we need to gather. I'd like to find another female if we could. If you have any suggestions, I'm quite open to it. All right, well, I think we're up to... If you need me, I'm with you. Eight vigilant now? Hello, friend. I think we'll stop at ten. All right, Cronag. Yes, you're with me. I know you've been training with uh, the Knight Paladin here, but it's time My for me calm. to take you out into I the field. It boiling. And I see you have decided not to go with the standard Hello, vigilant friend. issue, but at least you, you are wearing look. the amulet of Stendar. So. Good to see you again. I guess it's what we can ask can for. Can I help you? Yes, Mule. It's good to see you too. All right, let's go. Let's get on with it. All right, so you were going to take me to one of the orc strongholds, if you recall, so that I can get some block training. We're going to the preeminent block specialist in Skyrim. Let's go. It just so happens that the specialist is an orc. It's a good thing that I'm bloodkin with the orcs now. Come on, let's go. Greetings, greetings everyone. We're with the vigilant. I'm a strict follower of the old traditions. We mean Honor, you no harm. Strength, deeds. All right, it's Chief Larak, isn't it? I'm told that you. My place is chief, and my challenge is to lead my people. Very well. I'm told that you could teach me blocking. You should see my forge wife, Shuthars, if you need weapons or armor. I need training. You wish to learn from the best, eh? So be it. All right, then. Mm -hmm. I, am, I appreciate this. Need something? I will in a moment. All right. And now... Let me pray you don't mind, Chief. If any of you would like to pray with me, I call upon Stendar and ask for his favor and his guidance. And I meditate on my abilities and my skills. What's going on here? Did I level up? All right, I'm not even going to to ask. All right, so we have several perks here that we can distribute. All right, speech mastery. See how my lock picking is coming along. I've been struggling. All right. So that's better. Oh, my archery is at 100%. All right, so let's go ahead and finish off our archery mastery. Something is not right here. It's like, how did I level up so far? I don't, I don't even recall how this could have happened. Anyhow, we'll go ahead and crossbows, bows and crossbows do 100% more damage. And critical strikes with bows and crossbows do 5% more critical damage per level of archery. All 
right. And we'll go ahead. Shooting a target beyond 25 feet three times in rapid succession, leaving less than 2.75 seconds between each hit deals bonus damage equal to 15% of the target's current health. Max 150 damage and knocks the target to the ground. Alright, we'll do that. Let me just see, what is perfect aim? Hmm. Hmm. I'll come back to that. Oh, you know what I wanted. Yes, quick shot to be able to draw a bow or reload a crossbow 30% faster. Much needed. Now I can probably keep up with this three crows thing where I'm shooting in rapid succession. All right, well. Thank you, Stendar, for your blessings. Chief? Yeah? <laughs> I'd like some more trade. My mother, Sharumf, knows many remedies you may wish to take with you. Okay, I appreciate that. But can you train me some you more? You wish to learn from the best, eh? Yes. So be it. And you know, actually, you're not exaggerating. You are the best block trainer in all of Skyrim. All right, there we are. Thank you, Chief. Fight well. It's been an honor. Stendar, have mercy on you. This better be good. It was. All right. Was it Cronag, if I can keep remembering? Cronag, yes. All right, let's the go. The strongholds keep to themselves. Skyrim hasn't always been kind to the orcs. Yes, I can imagine. Let's see what we can do to help the citizens of Skyrim. All right, Cronag, we're here. What can I do for you, friend? Falkreath, of all places. I've heard that there may be a priest that needs our services. At least this is where... Night Paladin Cyrus thinks we should be. The god Arke was once like us, bound to winding mortality. But he willingly gave up this existence that we might better understand the vagaries Citizen. of life and death. Hello. It, Goost is responsible for the cemetery here in Falkreath. I take care of the shrine. Are you a priest of Arke? I am. I came into Arke's light after the Great War. So many died by my hands, hmm. my magics. I'm fortunate that Kust and the people of Falkreath have come to accept me as one of their own. Could you do an old elf a favor? I misplaced my journal in a cave I was exploring. I'll pay for its return. Yes. I believe Knight Paladin Cyrus saw your need and sent me here. I'll do it. Blessing of RK to you for your help. Blessings to you. Ah, you're a conjuration instructor? I'll teach you some of what I know, but be careful. <laughs> okay. I don't think I can uh, learn anything from you. I'm quite full of knowledge after learning blocking. May the spirit of Lavinia and all those who have left this world and its suffering know the beloved serenity of Aetherius. And may we one day rejoin them in eternity. Yes. I'm 
citizens. I, I sense that something's troubling you. I'm Zaquan. What? What the, the nerve? I'm Zaquan of the Vigilant of Stendar. A sad time. Ah, uh, really? Is this place always so gloomy? Yes, and I couldn't tell you why. My wife and I think there's some dark magic at work. Or perhaps R.K.'s influence is strong here, and he likes to keep it this way. Who died? Our daughter. Oh, I'm so Our sorry. Our little girl. She hadn't seen her tenth winter. How did she die? She was... He ripped her apart. By the divine. Like a saber cat tears a deer. We barely found enough of her to bury. Who did this? Who is he? Sinding. Came true as a laborer. Seemed like a decent man. He's stewing in the pit while we figure out what to do with him. If you've got the stomach to look at him. What could drive a man to do something like this? Well, I suppose I'll have to find out. Stendar's mercy be upon you. I just don't understand what kind of man does that. Well, the vigilant will find out. All right, let's look at my notes here. We are going to Bloated Man's Grotto. An orc follows to the death. All right. All right, here we are. Let's go, vigilant Cronag. What's the matter, friend? Those are the sort of skills I was thinking I had. Alright, let's, uh... I need to recharge this weapon. for his journal. Uh, another bear. Uh oh. I missed. It's all yours. Cronag. going to take a clerical posture. Oh, here he goes. Ah, oh, there you are. Okay. Is this place just filled with bears? What is it? Oh. 
Let's try something else then. I'll show you a real uh, fight. False light. There we are. Now this is what I'm talking about. May Stendar's mercy be upon them, for the Vigilant has none to spare. Let's keep going. to Talos. What's this Bolar's Oath Blade? And Bolar's Writ. To he who finds this know that I, Achilles, Bolar, last of the blades to survive the attack on Cloud Ruler Temple, took refuge here in this ancient sanctuary. The Thalmor have come for me, but they shall not desecrate this place. I go forth to meet my death with honor. If you are worthy, take up my blade and do the same. Hmm, okay. Let's just take a look at this blade. So it does 31 points of stamina damage. Creatures and people up to level 15 flee from combat for 33 seconds. Man, look at you covered with blood. You know, I remember when we found you in, in the, uh, was it Chill something? That cave that you were a prisoner? Can I help you with anything? I thought you were carrying a dagger, but little did I know it was just a shiv. So, I thought I would outfit you with daggers. My blood's calm. In Stendhal's I prefer name. it boiling. Alright, okay, I'll stop talking. Alright, here's the chest. Elven Bow of the Blaze. Burns the target for 31 points. Targets on fire take extra damage. Alright, here's some gold. Here is... Oh, excuse me, Runil's journal. Uh, scroll of Harrowing Dirge. Okay, we've got what we came for. Ah, uh, and we have wolves. Oh, no, you don't. I don't even see it. What are you aiming at? Oh, the Spriggan. Alright, the Matron is down. Good work. My thanks. You are welcome. Malakath, watch over you. <laughs> Stendar, watch over you. Hmm. I'll show you a real thing. Only a fool lets Got himself him. get surrounded. You know, I've never really embraced restoration in this way using false light. To suck the light out of. 
be your enemies. He's finished. Good work. slow. Alright, so oh, that's a spriggan. Ah! Has no interest in me and you. I bequeath upon you courage. Quite the savage. Stendar is pleased. Okay, let's keep going. Like we're finished here. Come on. A cave. Up for some hunting? I think we're done with hunting for now. All right, let's get back to Falkreath. My blood's calm. I prefer it boiling. <laughs> I bet you do. Runil. The number of graves in this cemetery never decreases. I have your journal. Thank you. It's a collection of regrets that I try not to forget. Here, I promise you this. Hmm, 1,500 gold. I appreciate that. All right. Until next time, then. Yes. Stendar's mercy upon you. All right. I think... Whoever can look. Yes, I'm th <laughs> trying to decide what we're going to do next. We do have a murderer that we need to speak with. What's going on here? Hello. What can I do for you, friend? <laughs> what? Are you all right? That's a question I've asked myself for weeks now. Am I all right? Will she be all right? Was it wrong to come here? Why? What's wrong? <sighs> I'm sick. I mean, it would be fine if it was just a cough, but... Well, my body hurts so much I can barely walk. And <laughs> those are the good days. Have you considered seeing the priestess in Whiterun? I've already tried. I'd heard that Danica Pierce Spring is the most powerful healer in all of Skyrim, but she couldn't help me. Mm. I'm very sorry I to hear that. I know now it's my destiny to die. That's why Archaea guided us here. Us. The divines often work in ways beyond our comprehension. We must have faith. It's an important lesson, one I didn't always heed. It's funny how the same hardship that makes us pray to the divines also makes us doubt them. You questioned your faith. 
Yes, believe it or not. When I was sure Henrietta was fast asleep, I'd crawl out into the forest and just let it all out. But all of that anger and hate left me the moment we came to Falkreath and met that sad couple. Here I was, feeling sorry for myself, yet my daughter is still alive. Hmm. But is this not for long? So, the Divines were sending you a message? That's right. When I talked to Indara, I found out the girl they lost was about Henrietta's age. Mm. An Imperial girl like her mother. How can that be a coincidence? How is that not the work of the Divines? Is your daughter being adopted? I believe she will. I've yet to broach the subject with them because their loss is so fresh. Oh, I see. Uh, maybe part of me is just unwilling to let her go. Wow. But I've told Renil of my intentions. Are you staying in Falkreath? Yes, I plan to stay here with my daughter until Arkay bid me leave. I've already arranged for a plot of land away from the trees where the stone faces east. It sounds like a wonderful spot. Thank you. It's funny, when they told me about the Grand Cemetery at Falkreath, I was so worried it might be too large. Hmm. I feared Henrietta wouldn't be able to find my headstone. Hmm. But when we got here, I was relieved. The graveyard is so cozy, and the priest is a kind man. You sound ready. I am. I was afraid to die before, not knowing what would become of my daughter. I thought she would end up lost and alone, a child few people noticed and nobody wanted. Now my heart is filled with more trivial concerns, and I often forget how lucky I am to have them. What sort of concerns do you have? I am worried she'll forget me. Mm. She's just a child, and the memories she has now will soon be replaced. I know when she's older, she'll remember Indara as her real mother. It's wrong to think so, but it almost makes me jealous. I just want to be a part of her life, even when I'm gone. Is there anything you can do to help her remember? Well, these last few days I've tried to tell her all the little things. The stuff she won't understand until she's older. How to brush her hair. How to tell when a man lies. Oh, of course, the that's most important. The perfect recipe for apple cabbage soup. <laughs> I thought if I showed her all the little things, the big things would speak for themselves. She wouldn't have to wonder how much I loved her. Yet, when I talk to her now, all my words float by like, like dandelion clocks on the wind. You could write her a letter to her future self. By the Divines. Why didn't I think of that? That's a wonderful idea. Thank you, stranger. <laughs> I'm glad I could help. I think Runil has a quill and paper he keeps for his journal. I'm going to get started right away. And if you don't mind, I'd like to ask you a small favor. I know she'll be in good hands with Indara and Matthews, but if you could look in on her from time to time, make sure everything's all right, I'd appreciate it. That's not a problem. Truly, the Divines must have sent you to answer my prayers. Thank you again, so much. May Stendar's mercy be upon you. <laughs> Is this, Hello, the, friend. is this the little girl here? <coughs> I don't like Henrietta? it here. There's too many bugs. <laughs> I suppose yes? you'll get used to it. It's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Zaquan. Nari's funny. She tells everyone how handsome and pretty they are. Mom says she does it for tips. Is there something I can help you with? 
Can I help you with anything? Mom says I'm getting a new mommy and daddy. So hmm. I'll have two of each now. Yes? Yes, you will for the time being. All right, Stendar's mercy. Can I help you? On both of you. And we'll be seeing you soon enough. She tells everyone how uh, handsome and pretty. Cronag, really? Mom says she does it for tips. Are you are you adopting the young girl too? Woman, but her constant <laughs> gossiping is a bad influence on Henrietta. All right. We have some vengeance to met out. My blood. Another gone. girl is dead, and the man is locked in prison. Let's go and talk to him.